Time now for First Alert Weather with meteorologist Kyle Kleckner. Welcome back. Thanks again for joining us on this Wednesday. Also, the first month or first day of November, rather. Temperatures starting the month off here on well, the colder side, maybe not very conducive for golfing. Maybe a better shot of some golf this afternoon when those temperatures warm up into the 50s and 60s for us. So some better temperatures on the way after a rather cold Halloween. It's a little cold out there still, just 18 in Oglala, also here at Lincoln. Also at 25 at Ord and Carney Holders, also that barn too. So temperatures are a little cold. Definitely going to want your coat again this morning and factor the wind in. Those wind chills are even colder. Had some single digits a short time ago. Most of those wind chills right now in the teens, some low 20s out there at the moment. So once again, don't forget your coat. You're going to walk outside and that cold air will hit you like a ton of bricks walking out here with these winds too out of the south. A little stronger in southern areas and central areas too. As winds roughly 5 to 15 miles now, some wider winds to our far eastern places and our western areas as well. So wind speeds will be a little more uniform out of the south and west, roughly 5 to 15 this afternoon. Of course, do have a few clouds here, especially in our western areas, although not much happening at the moment. Clear skies for most. We'll see an increase in that cloud cover, though, as we head throughout the day, mainly sunny skies to start. And then more partly sunny skies later on. Pretty quiet stretch of weather we've settled into here. Of course, there's a brief trough here off to our west. Not really much in the way of that. We will see a weak cold front work its way down from the north later on tonight, early tomorrow morning, although that cold front really not going to affect us really at all. Not much in the way of precipitation expected. No precipitation with that front tomorrow. In fact, temperatures a little warmer for tomorrow and even warmer yet for our Friday. So pretty quiet stretch of weather this next few days. Not really much in the way of precipitation, maybe until the weekend. Make a better shot, though, towards the middle of next week. 55 for an afternoon high today, finally warming up after a cold end to the month of October. 24 for a low tonight, mainly clear, calm night. A cold night, though, at that. 59 for a high tomorrow, touch warmer, mainly sunny skies do return. Some calmer winds will return as well. Temps today, mainly 50s for us, some 60s to our south and west. Temperatures tonight will be cooling off into the 20s. Pretty cold night once again, but tomorrow, this temperature is a touch warmer for us. Most of us still in the 50s, more 60s, though, across the area to our south and west. Of course, do have the pumpkin patch forecast looking pretty good these next couple of days. It's still that time of year to grab some apple cider, some pumpkins. Temperatures in the 50s and 60s for Friday as well. A dry stretch of weather for the most part this next week. So again, really no precipitation expected until maybe Sunday, maybe Tuesday of next week as well. Really, Monday might have a chance to. Temperatures not looking all that bad, really, overall. Some warmer temperatures this weekend in the 60s. Cooling off a little bit for the start of next week, but still pretty average this time of year. So really, all things considered, Sarah, looks pretty good. Yeah, it looks like a great weekend. I'm looking forward to yeah, it. Yeah, the weekend is looking fantastic, so enjoy it. Yeah.